a lot of whitetail hunting, but right now I'm in elk country in New Mexico trying to find a big bull elk and broadhead selection. You know, that's a big consideration when you're going into any hunt, whether it's something as small as a whitetail or as big as a bull elk. And so going into this hunt, I put a lot of thought into what type of broadhead I wanted to shoot. And I kind of knew right out of the gate that I probably wanted to shoot an expandable. Um, I'm a fan of expandable broadheads because they're very easy to sight in. And I don't like screwing around a lot with trying to get my bow sighted in and making sure it's hitting consistently out to extended distances. And typically you're gonna be able to get that with an expandable broadhead. You're gonna get that consistency in flight because of the compact profile. And assuming your bow is set up right immediately when you start, you're probably gonna get that field point type of flight out of your expandable broadhead. When it comes to other considerations of choosing your broadhead for a hunt, obviously you need something that's gonna do the job when the rubber meets the road or when the broadhead meets the flesh. So going into this elk hunt, I asked around, talked to a lot of different folks about expandable choices and the wasp jackhammer that I have right here came up in a lot of conversation, so I figured I'd give it a shot. The Wasp Jackhammer speaks for itself. Just go ahead and look at some of the reviews that are out there. It's an extremely reliable broadhead. It's got a great reputation. It's got that signature troll car tip that's made to just drill through animals, cut through bone, just punch right through. And it's got reliable expansion. And that will result in a massive wound channel. And with the right shot placement, that animal really shouldn't be going too far. So at this point in the elk hunt, we're coming down to the wire. Haven't had a chance to shoot at an elk yet. But when I do, I'm pretty confident that this broadhead is gonna do the trick. And hey, if I go home empty-handed, I'm gonna be jumping right into a tree stand to go after whitetails. And it's gonna be time to make some meat with this jackhammer. Yeah.